Colleagues describe Paget as both forthright and reticent. Now that may seem subtle, not that important, but that's actually a big clue. We have two words, forthright, which means open and honest, candid, telling people what you feel, versus reticent, which means you're tight-lipped, you're not saying much, you're holding back. So we say, aha, this person, Paget's a walking contradiction. She's two words that are opposite. So I look at the first blank, humble, hmm, what word is opposite of humble? And I get C, arrogant. By the way, diffident means, or similar to humble, it means lacking confidence. But now I can go on to the second blank. She's good natured and what? Well, what word is opposite of good nature? Good natured meaning someone who's easy to get along with. Guess what? Someone who's prickly is not easy to get along with. It's likely to upset them. So D is the answer there. Uh, solicitous means that you want to help someone and that doesn't fit the context. And phlegmatic just means you lack energy. It doesn't mean you're uh, opposite of good nature. Now, we have those two answers, and then we go on to the third blank. Paget herself does blank to these contradictions. Why? She says she is pro-employee, but avowedly anti-union. She calls herself pro-customer, but acknowledges that she runs a store with higher profit margins, etc. So the idea is, wow, she's even saying that she's a walking contradiction. She's explaining that she's one thing, then the opposite. So she does little to contradict or dispel and that leads us to answer choice G.